Hi everyone, today's tip on keeping your toddler occupied is making things with biscuits. So I'm going to make a biscuit train. It's up to you with their ability as to whether you think that they could copy you and make something like this or if you just wanted to make something completely different. The idea is that this is completely edible so it doesn't matter if you've got a toddler that likes putting things in their mouths or if you just want to eat it afterwards. So you will need today some biscuits, I have some custard creams and some bourbons and some icing sugar and all we're going to do is make them into kind of a train well we'll see so you're going to take some biscuits to start with and put them that way up and then you're going to get some more of your biscuits and dip them in the icing sugar just to get them to stick together to the next biscuit just like that and you're going to do the same on the other side. Children will love this because they can feel like they're getting really messy and lick their fingers and it's all okay. So there we go. I'm going to put that one there. And then we're going to dip this biscuit both ways because it's going just there, like that. So we're going to dip both ends in the biscuit. Or the biscuit in the icing sugar. Just like that. And we're going to do the same on the other side, just here. Okay, not too messy. There we go. We're going to take one of our larger bourbons and we are going to put it just here, but we're going to put some icing sugar just along this bit to stick it down so it doesn't fall over. So there we go. Just like that. And then we're going to lay our bourbons across the top behind it, just like that. You can put icing sugar all over those as well if you want to. And there we go. You can experiment with this. Maybe you could get some Oreos for wheels, or you could get some chocolate covered fingers to make a track. So you can make a whole scene of biscuit related edible fun. So have a go. See what your toddler enjoys making. It might not be anything to do with trains but see what they enjoy making and comment me, tell me what they're doing. But that's all for this video, so thank you for watching. And next time you will need some paper plates and some child-friendly scissors and some crayons, felt tips, or anything you can decorate this with. So check in again to find out what we're doing next video. Thanks for watching.